1,000 Elves sisters, Amy Slayton, always dreamed of being a mom. Now that dream has finally come true. There have been obstacles along the way. 1,000 Elves sisters star, Amy Slayton, rose to fame because of her weight, but lost 176 pounds after bariatric surgery. Her post-baby bounce back is also fascinating. Amy always wanted a couple of children, so after Gage Halterman was born in November 2020, she decided to do it one more time. Her second son, Glenn Halterman, was born in July 2022. Amy was born on October 28, 1987, under the intense sun sign Scorpio. The sign is known for its capacity to transform and regenerate. Over and over again, a Scorpio will be tested by life. If they develop a high level of self-control, they'll rise like phoenixes from the flames. Amy's been tested. It wasn't just being morbidly obese. It was also dealing with troubled family members, including 1,000 of sisters, Tammy Slayton, and recovering from a rough childhood that pushed her into a dangerous emotional eating habit. After two children, Tammy's flaunting her thinner body and evolving sense of style. As seen in Amy's post above, as per 1000 old underscore realidate underscore updates at Instagram, pregnancy was a special time in her life. For years, due to her weight, Amy wasn't sure that her dreams of being a mother would come true. She wanted children, but being so heavy might negatively impact her fertility or her health during pregnancy if she did conceive. Doctors advised her to wait until she was thinner. This desire to have babies motivated Amy to shed enough pounds to qualify for the procedure. Above, she celebrated a pregnancy milestone in a white goddess gown. Amy's Instagram is a place where she can express herself and share her journey, but sometimes 1,000 Elf Sisters fans turn on her. In the post above, Amy had very recently given birth. The little infant looked almost brand new, and Tammy was probably more exhausted than she'd ever been in her life. However, that doesn't stop fans from trashing Amy. Because the place was a mess, a lot of shade was thrown Tammy's way. One outraged troll wrote, Amy had a rough upbringing. Maybe no one taught her how to clean. Her mother, Darlene, wasn't exactly a nurturer. In light of what's been revealed since then, such as the fact that Amy was battling bipolar disorder in 1000 Elf Sisters Season 5, it's possible that Amy was living with untreated mental illness at that time. Fans should go easy on the Slayton sisters, but they don't. They didn't really grow thicker skins. Tammy seemed cranky, with an attitude, but she was dying inside. She recently admitted that she thought of taking her own life before she had weight loss surgery. Obviously, she was much more vulnerable than she seemed to be. Amy really wobbled in season five. She was often seen crying. Her marriage was falling apart. Caring for two kids under two was taking its toll. The sisters are fragile, but a lot of people don't care. They just keep dishing it out. Now that Amy and Tammy are thinner, maybe the shade bothers them less. Hopefully, they enjoy their lives enough that it doesn't matter much to them. The post above, via 1000 old underscore reality underscore updates, shows Amy with her ex, Michael Halterman. Here, she's in the midst of her post-baby weight loss journey after baby number two, Glenn. It's not easy to slim down after having a couple of children who are quite close in age. A lot of women find it hard to lose all the baby weight and Amy, who has struggled with food addiction, is no different. Amy got bariatric surgery in season one. She had her first baby following her procedure. In the post above, Amy wears a gray and black tracksuit. Her husband Michael smiles for the camera and Amy's smiling too. Despite the happy expressions, this couple had real problems. Later, Amy chose to leave Michael because he didn't help her with childcare and was too controlling. He even held her bank card for her, 
treating her like she was a child. After Amy left Michael and got help for her mental health issues, she began to bloom. There weren't as many tears, but life still isn't easy for Amy. She had a new romance with a man named Kevin, which didn't seem to work out. A series of fairly cryptic posts showed that that romance was probably over. In another TikTok, Haney said, Amy may not be lucky in love, but she always has her boys, Cage and Glenn. She also has Tammy and her pals. Amy's focusing on her mental health right now. She may do better without a partner right now, as her relationship seems so turbulent. As per U.S. Sun, Amy accused Michael of being and called 911 because she alleged that he was hitting the kids. If that's true, it's his fault and Amy is better off alone. The thing is, she can't really make it work with anyone. She may need to work on herself for a while. There's more to life than love interests. Amy needs to learn to really take care of herself. Men can disappoint. Instagram at 1000 old underscore reality underscore updates. Amy was ultra glam in a long red dress. Her blue hair was beautifully styled and shiny. She wore a statement necklace and lipstick. Usually, Amy doesn't look this pulled together. She was showing the world her slimmer figure and displaying enviable body confidence. Amy's lost so much weight. While Tammy's journey seems more dramatic, the fact that Amy's maintaining her weight loss results after having two kids is also really impressive. On Instagram, at 1000 old underscore reality underscore updates, Amy was ultra glam in a long red dress. Her blue hair was beautifully styled and shiny. She wore a statement necklace and lipstick. Usually, Amy doesn't look this pulled together. She was showing the world her slimmer figure and displaying enviable body confidence. Amy's lost so much weight. While Tammy's journey seems more dramatic, the fact that Amy's maintaining her weight loss results after having two kids is also really impressive. While wearing a stripless dress, the fitted black frock looked fabulous. Amy's comment, as shown above, was really endearing. She's open about not thinking she's perfect, but 1,000 Alb sisters, Amy Slayton's confident enough to joke about it. In the future, Amy may have more kids. For now, she's got her hands full caring for Gage and Glenn.